On December the 1st, 1955, Rosa Parks was booked and fingerprinted for violating the segregation law in Montgomery. She was tired and determined that fateful day when she refused to move to the back of the bus, refused to give her seat to white passengers. When artist Ted Ellis contemplated painting her home in the Cleveland Court housing project, he could sense how it must have felt not to make it back home when leaving for work that morning. This is what he decided to paint live in front of her home during the opening of his exhibit at Rosa Parks Museum on January 14, 2011. Ted would capture the simple dwelling as it looked and then using his creative talent place Rosa Parks in the scene as if she was leaving for work the morning of her arrest. Ted Ellis documents African American history and culture with his paintbrush and canvas. His heart completes the image. This is the first time ever that Rosa Parks' home has been depicted in a painting. Ted was able to get the basics onto the canvas before the Montgomery school children arrived. Ted always likes to work his art into a lesson about history and about fulfilling dreams. He always tells the story of how he left his college education field to follow his dream. He has loved art from grade school. With courage and determination of his drive to become a professional artist, he left his corporate life as a chemical engineer to go on to what he calls his magic carpet ride. So as the children ask him questions about the art, he tells them to educate themselves, to believe in themselves, and to make their dreams come true.